My name is Wes Wilson, and I'm a tumor immunologist and cancer researcher. I'm very honored to be this year's recipient of the Young Investigators Award from IMIG for my mesothelioma research conducted at the National Center for Asbestos-Related Diseases and the University of Western Australia. Pleural mesothelioma is a cancer of the lining of the lung, most notably associated with asbestos exposure. Unfortunately, currently, it's a very difficult to treat cancer and is associated with poor survival. The way it grows into the lungs and around the heart makes it hard to surgically remove. It has been quite resilient to our chemotherapies, and the lungs themselves are quite sensitive to radiotherapy, which has left this as, until recently, a modality only used palliatively. New advancements in immunotherapy have given hope for this set of diseases, but it doesn't work for every patient. New clinical trials run by my mentor and principal investigator, Dr. Anna Nowak, have actually shown a lot of promise, but I wanted to see if we could do more. Traditionally speaking, you don't want your immune system to attack your own cells. This is how you get autoimmune diseases like arthritis, diabetes, and lupus. But the same pathways that can protect your body from autoimmune diseases can also protect the cancer cells from your immune system. By using checkpoint blockade immunotherapy, we can remove those obstacles and allow the immune system to see the cancer. Radiotherapy is actually really good at recruiting and activating the immune system. And I want to see if I could exploit that mechanism to get a better local tumor response, as well as the systemic response to tumors elsewhere. When the mesothelioma cells are radiated, the dying cancer cells attract immune cells to clean up the debris. When that debris is shown to T cells, they are able to recognize that as something that's not supposed to belong there. And with the aid of immunotherapy, they are able to better clear and remove the tumor. What is more, my work explored that these T cells can expand and replicate circulate throughout the body, and find other tumors that look the same and attack those too. My work looked to understand and characterize the immune response to radiotherapy and mesothelioma to help identify targets for immunotherapy. I looked to see at the response to tumor regression at the local targeted site in combination to immunotherapy, and to explore and understand these distal effects on how the immune system can attack tumors far away from the treated site. While more studies are needed to optimize the combinations of immunotherapy given, I hope that this research becomes the groundwork for how immunotherapy and radiation are given together for mesothelioma, and I'm excited and hopeful for the clinical trials to come. Thank you again to the International Mesothelioma Interest Group Committee for this award and the opportunity to share my research with patients and the broader research and mesothelioma community.